In this video, we'll show you how to make a game pass on Roblox. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. We really do appreciate it. And make sure you watch this video right until the end to the full steps. And let's go and get straight into this. And just to add in as well, this guide will work on mobile. You just need to go and use Roblox on your mobile's browser. So here we are on Roblox, as you can see. So the first thing you need to do after you've arrived on the Roblox website is come to the top of Roblox. And all you need to do is go and press on this create button up here in this top row next to Robux. But the first time you press on create, you may go and get this big banner saying start creating and below that there's an option for manage my experiences. What you need to do is go and click on manage my experiences. That's where most people will be taken to. But if you haven't pressed on create before, you're gonna go and get this big option saying that. But anyways, once you're on the creations page, we can go and continue and make sure my creations page is selected. So the first thing we need to quickly decide before we go and create a game pass is if you're creating a game pass for a specific game. For example, if I wanted to go and make a game pass for this game here, Untitled Game, um, I'd need to make sure that's public. So I'm quickly gonna go and make it public now. So press on the settings cog, click configure experience, and then all you need to do is make sure it's public and go and press save. And that's literally it, that's all you need to do. But I know a lot of you guys are just creating a game pass for games like Please Donate, where the, the game or the experience um, you have doesn't matter at all. So don't worry about that. Basically, when you can go and click on create again to get back to here, Basically, everyone's actually automatically gonna have an experience created when they create a Roblox account. For example, this is the automatic one. It's your username's place. Um, so in my case, it's Epic Gaming Feral's place. Anyways, now we want to come onto this left-hand side here and go and create a game pass. So all you need to do is go and press on passes just here, and it's gonna take a moment to load. And as you can see, we've got this big option here saying create a pass. So the first thing you need to do is come down to this drop down menu here called select from public experiences. Now this only matters if you want to create a game pass for a specific game. If you just want a game pass to use in games like Please Donate, it doesn't matter which it is set to. But if you've got a specific game you want it to be for, then you need to select it here um, and make sure it's public as I just showed you to do. So in my case, it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna leave it on, on untitled game, but yours is probably gonna be on um, your username's place. As you can see, I've already got a game pass there. But let's go and continue with the creation of a game pass. So now the next thing you need to go and do is go and find your image, which you want the game pass to be. This image can be literally anything. Do just make sure it does fit within the Roblox rules. So personally, I'm going to go and upload my logo. So all you need to do is press on choose file and your file explorer is going to open. So there we go, I just uploaded my image and there it is and it's going to automatically set the past name as the file name so I don't want it to be YouTube logo. So go and remove the past name and now you want to go and set the name to what you actually want it to be and this name is going to be visible to people who may potentially buy it. So you can literally name this anything, um, I'm just going to name it guide around pass um, because I don't actually have a game but if you're using it for a specific game you want to come up with a cool name for it. And for the description, you can just explain what it's going to go and do. So I'm just going to do this is for a YouTube video. And then once you're ready, all you need to do is go and press on preview just like so. And it's going to start loading. And then this is what it looks like. And then if you're sure about it, just press verify upload and it's going to finish uploading it. And it's going to go and say pass successfully created. Now, nobody can actually buy you yet, buy it yet, which is really important to remember. And it can't be used in games because it isn't properly configured. Now all you want to do is come down to the pass and go and press on the settings cog and then all you need to do is press on configure. Once you've pressed on configure, um, we can go and edit it again, but what you need to do is come onto this left hand side and go and press on sales. Then we need to go and switch it on. As you can see, we've got this switch on the right hand side and then we need to go and set the price. Now what's really important when we set a price is this is the amount people are gonna be able to pay for it, but Roblox do take 30% and we only keep 70%. So if the price is 10 Robux, we only get to keep seven Robux and Roblox keep three. And also guys, just remember, um, if you're using it in games like Please Donate, this is the amount people will donate or pay for the pass. Then all you need to do is once you're happy with that, you can go and press save. It's important to know you can go and change the price at any time. You just need to come back to this sales page here. And there we go, we've now gone and created the pass. So if we go and click on create again, just like so. And then once you're on the experience page, I'm gonna go and take a look at this game here. So I'm gonna click on it and I'm gonna click on store. And as you can see, the game pass is there. But like I said before, you may just be using it for games like Please Donate, where it doesn't matter what the game is for. But there we go. That is how you can go and create a game pass. It's now for sale. I already own it because I created it. If you found this video useful, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.